Hey, once again, it's your boy Day Day for Triple D Gaming coming at you with another FS22. You know how we do it. Let's get to it. Alright, ladies and gents. It's a cold one. <laughs> As you see, overnight it done snowed on us. So, uh, a little bit before I wanted it to. But anyhow, we gotta work with what comes our way. Um, so the game plan is... This makes it to where you can really see where the ground's messed up here, too. Um, but the game plan is... We're going to remove a little bit of this snow. And then... Um, we have to go get that trailer. To uh, put our cow in. And then... Uh, go ahead and get rid of this pen. So we can get our new pen installed. And... Uh, they got they got more milk in here for us, so we got to snag that milk out of out of there again, and then uh, we have pallets ready. We got all kinds of stuff to do, guys. So let's get to it. I guess so. Uh, technically, I don't have the money to spend on it right now, but I want to use <laughs> I want to use my new toy. Um, so it was. Partly edited by me, partly by somebody else. But uh, yeah, we got the we got the triple D floor mats in there. We got the we got the seat covers, and right there on the armrest. I was gonna put it on the blade too, but I didn't. <laughs> uh, but the original one is only four hundred and some horsepower. This one's nine hundred and one horsepower, guys. And uh, 15 miles per hour. The original one is only 12 mile, miles per hour. So this is my new uh, snow removal tool. And then the original one uh, right here. As you see, 12 miles per hour. And it's only 435 horsepower. I should have made mine gray. Some type of gray or something. But we went with white. So big price difference too. <laughs> I made my sixty-five thousand. All right, but anyhow, let's get to it. So what we're gonna do is somehow I gotta get it to where, like, the fill trigger is showing for my controllers. Um. Because it's not displaying the fill trigger on the help on the F1 menu. Um, if I'm using the controller, I actually have to reach up and grab the mouse and wiggle the mouse to get it to show. <gasps> Excuse me. Wow. <laughs> to get it to show the fill trigger. So, like, whenever I come over here to fill my milk. Bumpy, man. I can't wait to fix that. Uh, let's turn our hub on. Alright, so <laughs> we got some snow in the bucket. Alright, so if we look at the F1. It just it's not it just isn't showing the fill trigger. Now if I reach up here and grab the mouse, wiggle it, it says start filling. Press R. So I gotta assign a button on my controller to that so it'll actually work. Alright, so I believe I believe that's all of our milk. Uh, yipper, yipper. Uh, what do we got here? We're gonna lose that total mix and everything, but I ain't, I ain't too worried about that. Uh, now our cows. Now when I go go get a trailer, I don't know if it it might just be worth or I might just be better off to. Uh sell the cows and go get other ones because the trailer I got a couple different trailers right and uh, let's see alright so this one here holds 12 cows obviously it won't hold all 15 that I have Oh, this one holds 6 and then I have these two as well and um the sad thing is the end game one holds more pigs than these. But anyhow, uh, 
That holds nine. That holds seven. Um, so I guess I could get this and then grab this too. Just renting them. Renting them though. So if I grab this one and rented it, that would be eh, almost the price of a cow. So <laughs> the cows that I have right now. Uh, I mean, I guess I could rent both of them just to get my cow out of there. That would be four thousand five. I don't know, almost six thousand just to store the cows until we get our remodeling done. Let's go ahead and drop this. It's a nice day today too. Look at that snow kick up, guys. That's awesome. That's great. I love it. I just wish, like how you look over there and you see the grounds covered in snow, but like up close, the grass, I mean, it's there, but it's not. I just wish it would look like that. It is what it is. Yeah, like I said, we're not going to go sell this right this moment. Oh, you guys haven't seen the new sign. Yeah, we installed a new sign on the farm. Triple D Gaming, welcome to Triple D Acres. Farming Simulator 22, you too. Yeah. That's how we do it. It's not how we do it. <laughs> Things are pain in my neck here trying to use the wheel to do that. Oh, so sensitive. I need to pull through storage. Hey, my milk's going to freeze out here. Ah, right, let's drop that. All right, guys. So what we're going to do. <laughs> just because. I mean, it'd be better if I actually had a snow plow. I wish they made the in-game ones to go on the... Uh, pickup trucks though instead of just uh three point you know what I'm saying you know what I mean ooh. Ooh. now I wish it actually went on the blacktop too to where you, you had to salt your blacktop <coughs> excuse me um yeah, cause outside of oh, outside of like your concreted areas it's only on the dirt roads not on the black top I'm sure everybody knows this is fun this is great I just never did it 19 cause I didn't want to deal with the crop calendar Hey, it'd be nice if you could sell your snow. <laughs> hey, who wants to buy some snow? I need we need to invest in a high lift too for the farm here. Uh oh. This is what I do at, at work. Actual work. 
plow snow with the high lift. Them drain covers. And they got them puppies sticking out of the ground pretty high. Hello. Yeah, I wasn't feeling too good over the weekend. And I had I had to work on my truck, so I didn't get any videos out this weekend. Matter of fact, like the last four days or so. Oh. We is back to it now. I want a time lapse so I can get more done, but I haven't played straight through for a while, so we're gonna play through on this one, I guess. Yo. Yeah. Play, playing in the snow, you know. This is great. I should upload this one in 4K too. But it'll take forever. Ain't I need a. That's what we're. That's our. That's the uh, goal, guys. Because it's going to snow again uh, next month. I got right this moment we're running um, one day months the following season I might change it to at least like two days so whenever it snows again we get a, a lot of playing in the snow um, but it is going to snow tomorrow too like right now it's December I believe January so it snowed and it just turned to January because it's early morning but it is supposed to snow again uh, yeah, in Feb uh, February and January too, I think. Maybe not. I can't remember. But I did say... <laughs> I did say, I think in the last video, that there was a, a surprise coming. I can, I can make you guys wait or I can spoil it now. Um, but I guess I'll go ahead and spoil it. It ain't really spoiling it because you guys haven't seen it, but I will tell you. This is a TP map, guys. It is a TP map. I just been wanting to do the uh, playing it straight through, kind of realistic like um, starting up our farm until we're able to expand and move on. Uh, but it is a TP map, not the one that's out there already. This is made by yours truly. <laughs> so there's. I would like to work on it some more and make it bigger than what it is. Um, I do, I do got some, a couple of big things on here, um, but to make it bigger than what it is isn't a problem. But uh, some of it re requires a new save game, so uh, then I would have to go through and, and reset everything the way I have it right now. If I was to uh, expand the map, <coughs> excuse me, but we do have um, what's it called? The terraform. We have that mod as well, so we could just dig anywhere we want. Which is a great mod. Um, in my opinion, it, it is a great mod. Um, but, in my opinion as well, 
you still gotta have the TP map like done up because yes you can go and just dig any ooh, hello <laughs> you can go and dig anywhere you want any way you want but it, it's not as satisfying to me um, like you gotta have the way I do my TP maps anyway because I make it visually awesome so the combination of a TP map and the new uh, Terra Farm mod is like a match made in heaven. So you could do your TP map, and once you like dig out your materials from wherever you got them or whatever, then you could just continue digging with the the Terra Farm. So I think it's going to be a pretty nice combination. In my opinion, I don't have a salt spreader or nothing. We're just going to plow the stuff and go because I don't think it's going to snow again until tomorrow, next month, whatever you want to call it. That's why I ain't too worried about purchasing a plow right now. We got to see how much money we're going to have. Um, once I love the fact that once the bucket's full now it keeps pushing the material i love that um but like i said after we are oh i want to get uh our transformation over here done first so that's why i didn't want to spend any money until we're done with that and then we can spend all we want <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I think. Oop. <laughs> Wrong pedal. Uh, I'm thinking maybe I should uh, time lapse it though. Just for the simple fact that if I don't, we're probably not going to get all this stuff done today. We'll probably just get snow plowing. <laughs> And I would just make it, I'll go ahead and just make it a longer video, but nobody watches it. It'll just get skipped through. Hello, something there. Enough. I'll let me get the snow off of that. Sure ain't. Sure is ain't. I mean, if I had an actual plow, like I said, I could have went and bought one, but I'm surprised ain't, I don't know, we'll see what mods come out. I'm surprised there ain't uh, more plow mods than what there is already. I could just sit here and plow snow. <laughs> I 
I ain't gonna worry about up there too much. Just because when we do our little transformation, it's just gonna delete the snow anyhow, so. Getting some curb. Uh oh. Ain't good. Kicked me off to the desktop. How did I miss all that? Alright guys, we're gonna get right along this bunker here. I guess we'll be done with this for now. Bumpy. <laughs> some some cases it's nice having the string ball loose, nice and nice and touchy, but other cases it's not. Yeah, in some circumstances. Get this little bit here. Alright, so now we got to go and grab ourselves a animal trailer or two. Get the rest of the snow later.
Alright, ladies and gents. Uh, that's it for now. I mean, it's not... I did this once before. And it came out different, like better. And I can't remember exactly how I did it. <laughs> uh, but it's okay. Obviously, we're going to do something different with this... Uh, with this little area right here. I actually might use this area right here for um, putting up shelves here for um, pallet or for yeah for pallets and front letter tools and stuff like that. I was going to put some of those shelves like over here somewhere but this here might actually be a good spot for that. Um, either that or We'll put a bunker or some sort here for storing um, some of our cow's food. And or a silo or something. We're going to do something. Uh, if I would have started from scratch. Oh yeah, I need to fix that too. That's what I should have did was raise this whole ground up. Um... Before I place that new cow shed there, because it. Whenever they do it, whenever you start on New Farmer, the stuff that's placed there, it sinks the ground down, and then you're left with this. So I should have raised that up first. But it is what it is. Uh, we, we added a little mud there in the cow pasture. So. That looks good. I just, I, I was hoping that I was able to add water puddles, but you can't do that unless you're in Giants Editor. And that's what I was going to do on our little road right here. But, uh, yeah, we had to add a little bud, uh, little, little stone in that. Um, I like the idea of the tree here. And added a little character, but it was in the road, so I just put another one there and moved it over. That's all. <clears throat> but, um... Yeah, it's not 100% what I wanted it to be, but uh, we'll figure it out. We'll come up with something else. So uh, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see what's coming, what's next, hit that subscribe button. And I'm out. Deuces.